Hey guys, the objective of this video is to find the buckling loads and modes for a simply supported beam. As you can see, there's quite a few steps, there's six, um, so we might have to go across two videos. But just to quickly show you, we're going to be finding the free body diagram of the deflected shape. We're then going to be using that to find the moments. We're then going to sub in that formula for moments into this formula here. We're then going to solve this for boundary conditions of our problem. Um, we're going to have an answer for alpha, which we're then going to find P, which is the buckling load, and V, which is the buckling shape, and then we can actually f um, solve for the loads and modes. So, let's go. Number one. So we're going to do a free body diagram of deflected shape. So as I said, we're dealing with a simply supported beam. So we have a pin and a roller. And it would ordinarily look like this. And we're going to come and put a load on it to make it buckle. So we're going to come here and put a load P. Now we want to draw the deflected shape. So the deflected shape, once this buckles, is going to bend out and buckle out. It's going to look like this, something like that. And for equilibrium, if we have a force going that way, we need a force coming this way. So we're going to put P there. So now we have equilibrium of our deflected shape. That's part one, very easy. Number two, we now come and take a cut to get a moment formula. So we're gonna find the moment. So I'm gonna take a cut along this beam. I'm sorry, just so you know, the length of just, this beam is just L. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come and take a cut of that, and it's of the deflected shape. It's very important, it's the deflected shape. So here's our support. That's normally where it would be, but we're looking at um, equilibrium of the deflected shape. So it's going to be like that. We have a force P and we're going to have some type of, so we have the shape.